Our phones are the germiest thing we interact with every day. In fact, one in six cell phones has been found with fecal matter on it. That's poop on your phone. We're here in New York City to ask random people if we can test their phones to find out how germy they really are. Real quick. No, I know, free, I know. A free no, disinfection no, no. and a free device. They said no. <laughs> Did you know your cell phone's pretty dirty? I can disinfect it for free right now. <clears throat> she said no too. Elmo! Elmo, you want your phone disinfected? You know your phone's the dirtiest thing you touch every day. We disinfect 99.99% of germs and bacteria. Living on your cell phone, smartwatch, headphones. I can do yours here real quick. Would you be interested in that? Okay, check it out, phone soap. What do you think? Still no, you can't resist. That was still a no. It's most helpful to find someone with their cell phone out, you know? All right, so not everyone trusted me with their devices, but we persisted and eventually we found brave souls who allowed me to test and disinfect their phones. Okay. So we're gonna swab your phone. Oh, I don't wanna do that. It, okay. No, it's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be worth it. All right, all right, all right. And then after that, we're gonna put it in phone soap. But I don't want people to know how dirty my phone is. I won't tell them what I find. <laughs> all right, all we'll right. We'll just look at how dirty it is. All right. We took samples from their phones before and after using phone soap, then put that on a Petri dish, which would allow us to see how much bacteria was living on their phone before and how effective the UVC lights were after. Where's one of the worst places you think that you use your phone? The bathroom? Yeah. Yes, we all do. A few years ago, no one would admit that, but we all know we use it in there, right? Yeah. And did you know your hands touch your cell phone hundreds of times a day? Oh yeah, so the cell phone is dirty, I know that. I almost call it the third hand you never wash. Yeah, that's true. Right? And do you wash your hands every day? I do. <laughs> well, why do you do that? Then why do you wash keep your hands? myself clean. That's right. Yeah. But have you washed your cell phone? No. no. Cell phone? Not just the camera. Okay, so think about it. So you touch your cell phone hundreds of times a day. So let's say you wash your hands and then you go grab your cell phone, your hands are dirty again, right? Makes sense? Sure. Everywhere we go, we pick up new germs, which end up living on our cell phones, especially in a city like this. That's why it's nice to come home and leave the day behind by disinfecting my phone in phone soap. So how often do you recommend doing that? We recommend at the end of every day. Okay. And that video will show why, because your phone does get dirty all day long. Right. These are some of the most interesting and frankly colorful results we have ever seen. And David, maybe you ought to think about using your phone a little bit differently than you are now. And if you're watching this right now on your phone, yeah, it's probably just as dirty. Unsurprisingly, phone soap effectively kills 99.99% of all bacteria and viruses that were found on these devices. If it's been some time since you've disinfected your phone, go drop it in phone soap.